All right, so this is the bolt that I sent off. It's for the uh, M44 Mosin Nagant that I bought from Springfield Shooters. And uh, here's a couple big pictures of the bolt before I sent it off to get polished. The bolt came back and I was just amazed. I mean, you saw how pitted and nasty it was. Check this out. I mean, this thing just shines and reflects. I could not believe that it got the majority of the pitting out. Now I know on camera that spot right there looks bad, but it, it really doesn't. I mean, it, overall, yeah, when you get it in the light, it doesn't look like everything came out, like right in through here and here, but look at that. That is just unreal to me how they were able to polish that up and I mean it's it's a mirror finish just absolutely amazing that really surprised me but and it's like that all around I mean they did a fantastic job One thing I did notice though, they did not do the bolt face. The bolt face and the uh, ejector off of the bolt. So I'm going to break it all down and take a look at other places where it looks like they did not hit when getting it polished up. And I can already tell that inside here they didn't either in this on the cocking knob. Inside here still looks real dingy and dark. But we'll go ahead and break it all down and take a look at it piece by piece. Alright, here is the Mosin Nagant M44 bolt that has been polished up. Totally broken down. And it is just absolutely beautiful with how they did it looks so much better than the crappy looking bolt that I sent them. They even polished the spring if I can get it to focus. There we go. Even put a mirror bright finish on the spring. The firing pin. And it is lubed up a little bit. So now you can really see that Tula hammer stamp right there. I mean, this thing just shines. Alright, now here's that piece that I was originally... The cocking knob. And yes, it was in bad condition. All nice and pitted and everything. But for some reason... They did not get inside here very well. I would have liked to have seen that done a little more in there, polished up, but trust me, with the way this bolt was condition was, I'm not complaining. I mean, this is absolutely fantastic, the job they did on, on this. And they did get inside the ejector spring area. But they did not do the bolt face for whatever reason. I don't know why. And the actual ejector itself.
to polish that up on the outside but they did not touch the inside for some reason. I mean, it's it's clean, but it's not polished. So, I don't know. But like I said, I mean, you remember all those pits and scratches and everything in that old bolt, those pictures beforehand? This is just absolutely fantastic. If I ever have to do another bolt polishing again, I will definitely recommend these people. And like I said, I got them off of eBay, or I found them on eBay. And it's a company called Fincher's Corner. Uh, Fincher's Corner 2012. They have 100% positive feedback. And it was $41 to do the Mosin Nagant bolt service. Now, but they also do have their own website. And you can find their website at finchurscorner.com. Finchurscorner.com. And they offer a wide variety of things. If it's, if it's a bolt, they can more than likely polish it up. Like on the left picture there, skull and crossbones etched on a milled bolt knob that's flat on your Mauser. They do a lot of forging and Mausers. That's mainly what's on this, a lot of stuff that's what's on this page. Complete pulp polishing services. But Mausers is not the only thing they do. Like right here, AK-47 bolt carrier and gas piston clean and polish service. They do Cerakote removal and polishes. Uh, Savage bolt services. Weatherby Vanguard bolts. Receiver facing mandrel for large ring Mausers. Locates receiver between centers for facing off and, con and uh, contouring. Bolt action rifle bolt jeweling removal service. Remington, Winchester, Mauser, Sacco, and more. Stayer bolt service. Schmidt Rubin Swiss K11 or K31 bolt services. Now they do not have the Mauser listed on this website, but they did do it through eBay but if you contact them they're in uh, San Augustine Texas Fincher's Corner 701 East Hospital Street number is 936-275-9042 give them a call or email them at Fincher's Corner at gmail.com I'm sure they will have no problems uh, telling you if you have a bolt that they can service or not but Fincher's Corner Absolutely, I definitely recommend them. It was a very well spent $41. And what you do on eBay, you buy it, pay them the $41, you ship it off to them, and do it with tracking, just in case, because you never know. And then they do, I think once they get the bolt in, they, they have it for about one or two days, and then they send it back, uh, priority mail. It only... It, it took, after they got the bolt, I think it took like three or four days for me to get my bolt back. And it's just absolutely gorgeous. Like I said, I mean, they did a fantastic job on it. And I will be referring them to all my friends. And that's why I'm making this YouTube video to get them out there. So there you go. Absolutely fantastic job. And uh, that's it. Take care, guys. Hope you like the video.